Right, so the next thing uh, we'll have a look at is area terrain. And area terrain can come in uh, two basic types, really. So you've got things that uh, block line of sight, so that could be uh, a high wheat field like this, uh, or a, a, a wood, um, or it could be area terrain that uh, basically doesn't block any line of sight. Uh, it's just flat like this uh, pond here. Um, when it comes to movement, moving across the area terrain depends on what armour you're wearing really. So it distinguishes between the heavier armour of mail and no armour and leather and padding. Um, so let's take each of those cases in turn. So we'll look at these sergeants, they're in mail, they want to move across this pond here. Um, being in mail, any of their movement that occurs within area terrain is halved. So their movement is four inches. You need to uh, bear in mind that the movement they're doing before they hit the area terrain is not encumbered. So there's an inch before they hit it, so that uses up one inch and is unencumbered. So they do their proper one inch, leaving three inches left. And that means the three inches is halved to one and a half inches as they're crossing through the area terrain. So they'll get to about here. So it's probably going to take them a couple of turns to get across that. So 50% if you're in heavy armor. If you're not wearing any armor or you're just in leather, um, this is where you have to do a little bit of maths because your movement is hampered by 25%. So you're moving 75% of your normal movement when you're in cover in that area terrain. So, these guys here are moving forward into the marsh. They're not wearing anything. Uh, their movement is six inches. So they'll move without being encumbered until they hit, which um, that's about an inch and a half for these guys. So they move an inch and a half, leaving four and a half inches of movement through the area terrain. This is where it gets a bit mathematical. So you've got to do 75% a four and a half. Now my head hurts, so let's imagine I'm a human calculator and that's three points smidgen and a bit. So you would then move the remainder into the area terrain, three in a little bit. Now, one thing to bear in mind is that sometimes you get into a situation where, let's imagine their movement took the front guys out, but the rear guys are still in. This unit, the next time they move, they're still limited, encumbered by being within area terrain till they're out. So these guys here, are not going to have their full six inches. So just bear that in mind. So it might take a couple of turns to get a unit through. So to recap, if you're in heavy armor, 50% of your movement is lost in area terrain. And if you're in no armor at all, you're losing a quarter, 25%. Now, just like any other movement anywhere on the board, uh, you can still run when you're in um, a wood. So we've got these uh, archers who are not wearing any, any armor. Um, they're going to run in a straight line. Now, that's six inches doubled is 12, and you lose 25%, so that takes you down to nine. So you can run a good nine inches. Remember, it has to be in a straight line if you're running. So these guys would just basically run in a straight line nine inches through the wood, obviously making themselves weary. 
dodging between the trees. <laughs>